Welcome back in the kitchen with Chef Ricardo cooking shop. It's amazing to be in the kitchen guys giving your favorite dishes and your favorite food. Anyway, we want to show you how you can make yourself some garlic prawn at home using butter and also white wine. It's an amazing recipe and to be honest you will love the recipe with a little bit of sweet chili sauce after finish off with some white onion and also garlic and you know what I mean scotch but and pepper and bits and pieces to give it a lot of flavor and a lot of taste which you need from it so guys enjoy the recipe subscribe to the channel and leave your comments remember you're free to donate to the youtube channel if you think you got too much money don't afraid the button right on top of the youtube channel guys right there click on it and it takes you straight to you can donate also remember you can follow me on Google Plus and also Instagram, Twitter and my Facebook like page. We have a lot of people on the Facebook like page. So things is growing really well and brilliant. Thank you so much and see you next time. Get a copy of the cookbook, 50% off. See you next time. Bye bye. Welcome back in the kitchen with Chef Ricardo cooking show. The place to be, the place to stay, the place where you find recipe. Anyway. Today we want to make you some nice lovely garlic prawn and hopefully you will enjoy this one are still in the shell as you can see. Um, basically I'm going to put a little bit of white wine on it also. Um, and next we got garlic. Let's say we got the prawn right over here. We got the garlic, fresh garlic and some fresh spring onion, fresh thyme, fresh pepper, fresh lemon and fresh white onion all of these ingredients is which gonna make the different with the garlic prawn so hopefully you will enjoy the recipe subscribe to the channel and leave your comments and i know you guys gonna enjoy this one because it's a lovely recipe and a lot of people love prawn especially if you're a fish person and you love your fish and you love your seafood and all these things um basically you can have it on its own if you want to have it with some rice or whatever you like to have it with it's up to you you know, I mean, there's, there's nothing specific for of the garlic prawn with. You can have it with all potato. It's up to you what you like to have it with. So anyway, enjoy the recipe and subscribe to the channel. Subscribe to the channel, guys, and remember to donate if you got too much money at home. And you say, you know what? Donate some to Chef Ricardo. He's doing a good job. Thank you so much for all so far donate and still going to donate. Thank you. Bye bye. So we're gonna start yeah make sure you got a medium sized frying pan on the stove and we're gonna start off like this we're gonna use some butter a teaspoon of butter the reason why we want to use some butter because the butter will give it a flavor and also a taste simple get the butter all over the frying pan like this next thing put a little bit of the garlic with the butter so the garlic and the butter give it a lovely flavor I think the salt cake it like this don't do what I'm doing please guys so as you can see the butter being just melting all over the front pan with the garlic so you're getting that lovely flavor and that lovely texture from the garlic and the butter so what's gonna happen now I'm gonna put in a prawn just like this in it and you want to have it on a medium size eat don't put it on an eye eat because the eye eat gonna just make it fry and burn up everything which you don't you doesn't want that you want a nice lovely texture and flavor from the garlic on the butter and all i'm gonna do also is get the prawn in and we're gonna pop a little bit of white onion also inside of it to get it some flavor maybe a spring onion now they can see how the prawn is looking so lovely. Really nice. Garlic prawn. Beautiful recipe, guys. And you don't need to turn up the stove too high, guys. You need to have it on a medium size heat to get the flavor. And put some more garlic just to get the flavor. Just a little piece of fresh thyme. Squeeze it, get the flavor from the thyme. Also in it, really nice. 
So as you can see, it's frying lovely and nice. So basically, you just want to just get it all over. Just simply stir it up and get the flavor all over the prawn with the garlic and the butter. It's not something which you want to rush with, guys, and doesn't do it the right and proper way. All right? You want to just take a little time. As I say, lovely and nice. So we're gonna continue getting that flavor and that taste right in it. I'm gonna use some white wine also in it to give it a lot more flavor. Nice one. So as you can see, I'm just gonna pop a little bit of fish season on it because I've been having this like this for the last good seven minutes now. A little bit of coarse pepper. And what we're gonna do. Basically, you can use your kind of wine where you like to use at home, but I'm just using my wine Which I'll have right here with me as I can see looking lovely and nice so far Just to get the flavor with the butter and the garlic. So now we're gonna add some white wine to it So basically what what's gonna happen the white wine gonna cook down with it and give it also a lovely flavor and a lovely taste serious this this is just fantastic guys it says garlic shrimp cooked down in white wine is gonna be amazing recipe so basically what you need to do I've been cooking that for the last good seven minutes you don't want to overcook the prawn and make it feel hard you want to get it at the right texture and the right flavor and the right taste so basically as you can see what's happening inside of the pot right here guys so I just add a little bit of fish season to it and a little bit of coarse pepper so what we want to do is simple sprinkle a little bit of the spring onion to give it a lovely flavor and a lovely texture on top of it so as you can see it's cooking down now so I'm gonna leave this for another good five to six more minutes just like this you can cover it if you like to let us leave my own at the moment open nice and lovely so as you can see slow cooking at the moment looking lovely and nice so we're gonna put the scotch bonnet pepper in it and now we're it cook right down to, to that lovely flavor which you are looking for all right lovely and nice as you can see garlic prawn beautiful recipe Nice and lovely so right here as you can see guys this is finished so basically we want to share it out to make you guys can see exactly what we are talking about look at the sauce you don't need the sauce to be thick this is garlic prawn enjoy the recipe we're gonna share it out now hopefully we like the recipe is not nothing too long it's nothing too complicated it's just really beautiful and nice but before I serve it out what I'm gonna do is simple pop a little bit of sweet chili sauce on it like this you can get sweet chili sauce in the shop or the supermarket to buy seriously really nice with that on it guys beautiful recipe then what you're gonna do is simple catch that flavor from the garlic down there with the, that lovely butter and taste which is coming out of it so now we're gonna share it out and make you see exactly how it look on the plate enjoy the recipe nice and lovely so i just share it out as i can see the look the flavor the taste and everything and all you need to do a simple pop a little piece of a lemon on it like this put a few spring on and of it as you can see a little bit of time on top more flavor more taste everything so enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the channel and leave your comments guys. We've got a lot more recipe coming out for you. As you can see, this is garlic prawn cooked down in white vinegar. White. <laughs> white wine. So guys, enjoy the recipe and subscribe to the channel. Sorry about that. And we got a lot more recipe coming out for you. As you can see, we have a little bit of uh, so of sweet chili sauce pour on top of it just to give it an extra more flavor and i know you guys will love it 
So see you next time and thank you so much for watching my cooking show, Chef Ricardo Cooking Show. The best of the best. See you next time. Bye-bye.